Hello everyone, this is Viren. Firstly, thank you for taking out time to see this video and hopefully by the end of it, you're going to know how to set up a Facebook page of your own. So without wasting any time, let's get started. You're going to have to go to Google Chrome or whatever browser you're using, log on to Facebook and visit facebook.com slash pages. So this page loads up where Facebook gives you suggestions for pages you would like um, and on the top right corner you would find a create page button. So there are a lot of options whatever kind of page you want to create you could want to create a page for a local business like a restaurant or something for company organization or institutions for like a college brand or product which mostly a lot of companies use for their products um, if you're an artist band or a public figure you can use that option Entertainment is generally for pages that are not associated with any company and it's just for pure entertainment like the name suggests or a cause or community. So I'm going to try and create a page for my website themarketingguy.in. Um, let's select a brand or product. There's a lot of categories to choose from so I'm going to scroll right down and select website. You add in your brand name. For me, it's the marketing guy. And let's get started. So there are four basic steps in creating a Facebook page. Um, you're going to have to start with telling Facebook a little bit about your page. So let me just go to my website, the marketing guy dot in where I already have a little about written. And I'm just going to copy paste this. You're also going to have to mention your website name. So let me just copy that as well. And save it. Next, you have to upload a profile picture for your page. Thankfully, I have a one very basic photo already ready to upload so let's get that up here we go um, click on next there's something called add to favorites and if you add the page to favorites you're gonna start seeing it right below the news feed button on your home page let's click on next Preferred page audience. Now, this is something very interesting. As you all know, there are thousands and millions of people on Facebook and not everybody is an audience for your page. So what happens here is that if you narrow down your audience and tell Facebook that this is the kind of audience I'm looking to attract to my Facebook page, then Facebook will make sure that these are the people who get to see your posts. you can segregate your audience based on location, age, gender, interests and languages. In our case, well, I'm going to be making all the posts and videos in English. So that's important. I don't really want to segregate people based on their location or age or gender as such, because I'm going to be posting mostly about marketing. So it makes more sense to narrow down the interest group to marketing. I can also go ahead and add some social media sites or advertising platforms like Facebook, AdWords, Instagram, Snapchat and so on. I think this is good for now and we can go ahead and save this audience. And congratulations, you have your first Facebook page set up. Let's just briefly go over everything that you see on this page. Firstly, you can add a cover photo. I have one prepared for my page. There we go. You can save this.
and with that your Facebook page is now set up. Why don't you go ahead and set up your Facebook page just like I showed you in this tutorial. I'll come back for the part 2 of this video where we'll go through all the options you have as an admin of this page.